I'm Man. What? I am back. I hope, um, I hope another plane doesn't hit the towers. Honestly, I feel like this song right now. It looks sludge. Mm -hmm. Alright, we're playing Fear and Hunger. Uh Oh Um poison Black growth hormone. Blue. Uh, healing properties for muscle tissues. Okay, so blue's healing. Protein rich substance yellow. <clears throat> Black and oil highly flammable. Black, blue and yellow heightened senses. Red and yellow adrenaline boost. Blue and red poisonous effects. Blue and purple antidote. Blue and purple is an antidote. Okay, now, okay, so I made the poison, now I can make the white vial. Uh, okay. And I got two of them. Be cured. Alright, I gotta get the worms out of the girl. Uh, I don't think I have any more worm juice. How's my hunger doing? Hunger's fine. She's... Not doing too well on HP. That's not good. I don't want to fuck with the fucking cherubs, man. Here, we'll get we'll get in spooky mode for this. 
five tinder boxes. Small key. Can I get some bone or worm juice, please? Oh shit, the fucking elevator's down. Right. Oh, perfect. Um, do we have rotten meat? We do. We are in the fucking money. Do I have a torch? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I'm coming, Moonless. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm gonna come. Where? There's Moonless. Let's go. Skill. Talk. Guard. Upper meat. Skill. Talk. Offer meat. Moonless seems to respect you to a certain degree. Let her join your party. Let's go, best party member. Huge creature changed the wall. It's all dried up. It's uncertain whether it's alive or not. Breasts are oozing yellow mucus. Mmm, milk some of it. Milk it again. Oh, I can't. I don't have an empty vial. What is the yellow mucus? Just yellow vial? This is the um the protein, right? We can use that for uh, heightened senses. I'm not poisoned anymore, but the infestation brewing inside the girdle is not good. Need the worm juice ASAP. Or she just dies and it's just me and Moonless chilling. That that works. Oh, fuck. What a pocket cat. How are you doing on this wonderful day? I want to die. Don't we all? Don't we all? I'm sure it's peculiar like that, huh? Life is peculiar when you're peculiar. Got that right. I'm liking you already. You know, we just met, but I feel a connection forming here already. I hope you don't mind if I ask this straight. <clears throat> Living humans are divided into two groups. They're children of light. Those destined to walk under the bright sun. Those people do well in hardships. They have dear humans who they want to return to. Even in the darkest hour, they can feel warm for their loved ones in their heart and gain extra courage. On the opposite end of the spectrum, there are people of darkness. Those humans are often driven to depression and sorrow because of life's peculiar ways. They've learned how to live with those feelings. In fact, they have grown to love the ever-pressing darkness within. Those humans are able to draw energy from darkness. They are not dependent on other people. They only need darkness, their old friend. Yo, it's like me. The humans are in darkness. Which one are you? I'm darkness. Yes, they all are. I suspected as much. I'm glad you were able to be so honest with me. Tell me, do you love me by chance? Yes. Right. You really aren't a human of darkness. You just said so because you thought that's what I wanted to hear. That's all right. Really. However, you must always remember to be yourself in every situation. Even if you love someone. You get, because you, if, you're base, if you base your love on a lie like that, it won't end well for you. Well, it probably won't end well anyways, but that's life. Peculiar as always. Anyways, I'm a merchant of swords. I sell precious items and weapons for those in need. The funny thing is, though, I don't want your gold or silver. I will trade items for human children. Bring them to me and I'll make it worth your while. My pockets are very deep, you see. Well, hello, stranger. And hello, little one. What a pretty little face you are. I like your hips and ankles especially. Girl seems to be scared of pocket cat. I'm going to make an offer you cannot refuse just for you, my special customer. I'll trade the little girl to an I uh... I will trade the little girl to an item of your choosing. Uh, no deal. Oh, how disappointing. You sure about this? The offer last. Come back to change your mind. Okay, I can get some worm juice. I'm getting scared. But she's getting hungry because the worms are fucking making her hungry as fuck. Here's some dried meat. Um... Oh, her mind is, like, negative. We have to, like, smoke weed. 
Smoke. Smonk. Do I have a pipe? I do have a pipe. Smoke opium. Yeah. Who will smoke? Girl. Hundred mind. Smoke opium? Yes. Who will smoke? Me. Mercenary. We're fucking max mind in. Oh, my torch went out. Oh, that was bad. New torch, please. Okay, fuck these flying bastards. Fuck you. Excuse me. You feel a terrible presence in the brain in these dungeons. Um, I will take the torch, actually. I need some. Take a stone. You notice a person kneeling in the darkness. The person doesn't seem to radiate immediate danger or aggression, and your presence seems to remain hidden. Show yourself. It looks like Anki. I think it is. It's out of the shadows. No, it's not. Oh, new visitors. My name is Nosferamus. I'm an al alchemist living down here. Pleased to meet you. I can't quite tell the alchemist is a woman or a man. Something about his, his stature seems almost otherworldly or ancient. Nice to meet you, too. The white-haired alchemist gives you a smile that seems almost too genuine. My apologies. I left the kettle on. I'm, a bit in, I'm in a bit of a hurry. Let's meet again. Okay, goodbye. Bye, mysterious sage. The person disappeared in the darkness. The echoes of his footsteps sound distant, but vanishing completely. A terrifying presence has entered the room. Uh, oh my god, we are fucked. Moonless not now, dude. What if I get into a fight? I can't even run from Chromaller here. for the time. Uh -oh. We have to end this and end that. And then put my music back on. Do you need me? <laughs> That makes me happy. I mean, I'm I'm losing RP with this, but maybe I maybe I earn it. Maybe maybe New York has better internet. Okay. I think we just do the fight. I think. Can I heal, um, what's her name? She has no HP. Blue and yellow. Pinecone pig. I gotta check the alchemy. Lumia Island's hyperloop will soon be open. Blue is Survivors, healing. Prepare to enter the experiment. Blue and yellow are heightened senses. I just need blue. I do have a blue vial. That is not a lot of healing. Reach for it. Alright, we have to fight the Salmon Snake after this. Oh. You're not a... Lumia Island's Hyperloop will soon be open. Survivors, prepare to enter the experiment. Yeah. 
Du schauen. Du schauen. Oh, was schauen. We will then resume our next experiment. Let there be glory to the pawns who reach the end of despair. Don't feel sorry for them. Just get me everything they have. Yes, I could stop with this. I need to go to a place where people need color. I didn't do anything wrong. Maybe I was a bit arrogant. I'm going somewhere with like this, right? Yes. It's been a while since I felt accomplished. I need to go to a place where people need color. I don't expect people to understand. This is what I can do. I'm glad I learned it. It's hard to concentrate. It's been a while since I felt accomplished. It's Trying to dodge payback by dying? Not gonna happen. It's hard to concentrate. That is very unlucky. Do I look like a raccoon? This man respawn and just get instantly killed. A blazing fire. You still have a long way to go before you can take me back. Hi, Lumi. I prefer breaking over stabbing. Pierces through me in an instant like an arrow. No, I'm everything down. We'll give this place some color. I used to get lost in this. No human can escape pain. I need to go to a place where people need color. I used to talk to him a lot. Just take my money and get out of there. Can you share it with me too? Everything looks black and white.
Uh, oh. 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 I did not know. I thought he was trying to farm. What does Redbook even do for him? I don't even know what the fuck it is. To be honest. Like life still? Damage. When will I be able to rest peacefully? He was soon. Just take my money and get the out. The battle zone has been activated. There's no way out now, except to survive. Yeah, I don't know about that. Well, I guess... I guess not. Man, maybe... <laughs> maybe false don't fade the way. We still have a long way to go before you can bring me back. Oh shit, I'm a dick, man. Trying to dodge payback by dying? Not gonna happen. She lives. You still have a long way to go before you can pay me back. What the fuck? This is my time. Right. Oh. oh, you're fucking dead, man. Oh! Oh my god. <laughs> Everyone went to that alpha for some reason. Okay. My bad. Yes. Pain is a choice. I really want this, though. Will you share it with me? <gasps> no! Don't, do not kill me. No! You still have a long way to go before you can pay me back. Dude, I'm so Try fucking to dodge pissed. Back by dying? Not gonna happen. Are you locking me up again? I don't expect people to understand. What? I think I die here. Just take my money and get out of there. Everything down. We'll give this place some. What? Get out. You thought money could solve everything? Ha! I hope I'm going where he is. Fuck that. I hate I think that was probably a kill I could have taken, but I think I die on top of it. I don't know if that's worth it. Potentially. I think it's just safe.
Oh, you're dead. Oh my lord. Darn it, cool. Yeah, we're not really having a great Quick rest. Keep moving. Great game here. Uh-oh. I'm just dead. Holy shit. Are you fucking kidding me? Ah! Not Jesus Christ. It makes me think of my siblings. What the fuck? This is uh, a little active for me. No matter how hard I try, there is a void I can't fill. You still have a long way to go before you can pay me back. When will I be able to rest peacefully? Yeah, so what happened was you uh, you raided me, and then New York uh, had an internet problem, and everyone in New York lost power or internet, so... Uh, yeah, I'm back. Oh, hello. I'm just fucking dead. Oh my god. Dude, you've got to be shitting me, man. <laughs> just what? Okay. Thank you for going live again, you yeah, no problem. You still have a long way to go before you can pay me back. I I've never seen the third parties like this. Like constant. Do the down abilities do anything? Yeah. So you can um you can blow up not gonna happen. You still have a long way to go I think I gotta rethink my um my augments. They're not really helping me at all. Also without my chest piece I am actually so weak it's insane. This is Wick. Well, that's not good. You can blow your head up, you can crawl faster, uh, or you can try to res yourself. It takes a while. It's, you basically have to use it like unbreakable, but as soon as you take any point of damage, it interrupts it and you die. If you uh, are a Dead by Daylight person. That is the equivalent. No way we're doing this. We take this so slow. Oh my god. Quick rest? Keep moving. 
I could use this. I feel a bit better. Is this Buster Rhymes? No. It's above the Gorp shit. It's, um... House of Pain. To be honest. It's crazy. To Everybody knows House of Pain for, uh... Jump around, but... Yeah. Didn't see, thank you, no problem. Oh god, this team. See, win that with Ghost Light? Just take my money and get out of here. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Uh, I want to buy. Are you dead? What a pity. I have no items. Right, two teams just died in the time that pinged. Oh, We don't want to get like fucking double teams. I think I think this this one's probably better. Oh, he's going in. Oh, that's not anybody. Nah, I don't do any fucking damage, man. I need Luke with damage, man. Luke does do does no fucking damage. He's building full tank, but it's like we don't have, we don't do any damage when we go in. I don't know if we are just super behind or what. But I mean, I don't know. I gotta I gotta go back to playing like 
the other shit. I don't think what I'm doing is working. It's pretty frustrating to try something new and then it's like, eh, this kind of sucks. I just die instantly. Maybe I run bitter. I could try that too. People who have had success with bitter. I don't know. And bitter makes sense on paper as well. Try this. That better. Um, what were we doing here? All right. Salmon snake. Um. I forget, did we blind him? I think we blind him. Moonless one for the eye, nice. It's good. Struggles to sense you. Pretty sure this is the right course of action. You got the tongue. That's bad. Um, we have black orb. We should be using it. Oh, I think the tongue goes down here. Oh no. That's fine. Don't kill a girl. Should have done this. They didn't catch on fire. Um, I need to do something for what's her name. Full healing on the girl? Have her guard? Okay, maybe that was a poison potion. <laughs> what the fuck was that? She's just dead. I don't even have a anti-poison. Highly flammable. That probably would have been the play. Highly flammable first. 
Alright, well, she's dead this turn, so... I think I need to restart anyway. She lives! 1 HP? Wait, what? A poison can't kill, huh? Might as well just go ape shit. But I don't think he can actually attack anymore. Could be wrong. Victorious. We got a stone crown. The crown is made of a finer quality stone, which makes it shiny, but the crude design suggests it's not worth much. Use skinning knife? Sure. I don't have a stone? That's bad. Uh. I wonder if I can come back with a a stone. A soul stone. She is weak from hunger. She's also dying from every single possible illness. We're praying. Take the torch. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. All right, I don't want to fight this guy. I, I, I don't want to fight this guy. Uh, not now, anyway. Oh. Beer good. Well, do we have... Oh, we do have audio. Nice. Hey, we're fucked. We are indeed fucked. Unless I can go back... Moonless is hungry. That's not good either. Hey, man. Oh! Alright, well, game over. I don't think you can run. Wait. I don't have another lantern, do I? Uh, no. Now this is over. Also, I can run. But I don't think you can run. Throwing knife. No. Well, let's go while it lasted. It was unable to escape. Goodbye, Moonless. Oh, Moonless is alive. <laughs> Goodbye, me. I mean... Fuck it, right? Now I'm dead. How am I not dead or blind? Realistically, if I had like a proper setup, I could 
I could maybe kill the Chrome Waller, but... I'm so fucked. Uh. Ouch. What if I am? I mean, blue orbs by themselves, do they do anything? Minor heal? Oh, it's very tiny. Alright, well, I'm blind. Pretty sure that's... That's done. Skull. Oh yeah, I can't attack anything. I'm blind. Dead. Mm -hmm. I didn't do that earlier. Run. Wait, you could just... Wait, you can run? Oh, right, I'm blind. Yeah. Run! I love how I, I can run. I'm actually... I'm moving right now. I think I got away from him. It's just, to, I mean, it's total darkness, but like, there's a faint... There's a faintness. Okay. Anyway. Search all this. Oh, raw meat. Okay. Oh, it's starting to feel hungry. Ambushes tapeworms, man. herb stick the girl is very tense and afraid yeah she needs to smoke weed and or opium and I have just the thing pipe smoke opium girl okay fear is such a distant emotion yep we are fucked up. Now we're burnt bodies. Oh. You wanna pray? Yes. I'm done praying.
Okay, let's get Moonless. Oh shit. Um, I'm poisoned. That's really bad. Hey, can I can I just chill out one turn? You know, blue vial is I need a white vial. I have one of those up to white vial. Surely Moonless just stares, right? Yeah. Food. Offer meat. Moonless joins the party. Thank you. That's milk. Milk the breasts. Give me the yellow mucus. Thank you. Sick. Like nothing ever happened. I'll talk to Pocky Cat, he's got nothing for me. Terrible presence in these dungeons. Take the torch. Light the torch. Okay, do I have. A full healing. Claims to fully heal you in all status ailments. So this is a bullshit potion. That's not what it did. <laughs> that is not what it did. Um... But I do have a murky vial. Murky vial into priest lantern. Meat cleaver is better. What? Uh, worth a shot. Let's see. It's a person. What up? Oh, they just left. Never mind. I didn't introduce myself this time. I'm sure that won't be a bad thing. Not at all. Can I get some worm juice, please? My girl has the worms. That's not a good sound. Um... I have to get lucky again. I hope she doesn't get killed. Purple. Okay. Purple is poison. Blue and purple is helium poison, so it's antidote. How do I not know how to make a blue potion? is attacking the eye. Smart. Nice. 
not attack me. You can attack Moonless. Uh, Murky Vial. Into Priest Lantern combo. Let's see if that works. That sucked. Vile did go hard. Get his ass. Oop. Oop. It kills. Fencing up. Well, Moonless is just gonna keep attacking. It's not like I can. Really stop Moonless from getting his ass beat. Her ass beat. That's not good. Just don't double hit the girl and we're okay, I think. Just hit Moonless. Oh, that actually really hurt Moonless. I hate the black orb so many times. But... Okay, we're good. I'll never smoke more opium after this. Can't attack, right? Yeah, we're good. Scarred. I'm pissed I don't have a soul stone. as fuck. Headbutt? Get the fuck out of here. He missed, but that is really unfortunate. I was on the girl, but she dodged. Some crown. Skin him. So what is the stone crown? I feel like the stone crown prevents... Some sort of status or something. Can she equip it? She can. I don't remember what it does. Do you need me? <laughs> that makes me happy. Means letting me know what's up. I don't know if false out's the way. I think Quake's fine. Like this and this. Bitter on paper works really well, so let's try that. Didn't come to find me, so I came. Numia Island Hyperwave 
soon be open. Survivors, prepare to enter the experiment. Lumia Island's hyperwave will soon be open. Survivors, prepare to enter the experiment. We will then resume our next experiment. Let there be glory to the pawns who reach the end of despair. Oh. Listen up. It's time to make me some money. Look at this shit. Back into the zone anyway. I didn't do anything wrong. It's all broken. Unlucky? I'm confident in my ability to craft things. It's been a while since I felt accomplished. Will you share it? Way to go before you can pay me back. Sometimes I feel pain for no reason, like I'm burning. It's been a while since I felt accomplished. Responsibility for the time I've lost. I need to go to a place where people need color. I'm tired of being trapped. I wonder who this was on a camera. Make me suffer. <laughs> oh. 
What? 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 Take your time. Savor it. I can't fucking kill him. Take your time. Savor it. Everything looks black and also, that is bullshit. <laughs> oh, this is getting interesting. Don't worry. <laughs> I love how Sua can just put W on herself and then it cancels my fucking R. That is uh, definitely not intended. We just heard this song, didn't we? Show me where to go. Fish and I share the same fate. Just take my money and get out of there. Give us a to the cold and damp. Will you share it with me too? My guy's dead. Take your time. Savor it. Nice for you. Make me suffer. I feel a bit better. I can't wait to show him. What? 
Oh yeah, something for us. Maybe? Leave it here, right? My turn. They're weak. Where people need colors. I wanted to go to the beach with them. Can I just walk out of the oh <sighs> when will I be able to rest peacefully? Talking about. They always say the first time is the hardest. Oh, I come to a place I shouldn't have. Try to dodge me back by dying? Not gonna happen. <laughs> oh, you got you, you guys have one of those? Oh. Oh, this is getting interesting. Oh, I look like a Take a quick. I need to go to a place where people need color. Everything looks black and white. What in the world did you do? They always say the first time is the hardest. Give us a pose. Let's save this moment. Oh, this is getting interesting. Nice view. Give us a pose.
I guess I'll have nice. to get used to the fire. It's all broken. Let's save this moment. what I'm talking about. They always say the first time is the hardest. What in the world did you do? Just take my money and get out of there. Embraced a blazing fire. Oh, I've come to a place I shouldn't have. I need this metal home. Super bad. My mind has cleared up a bit. This is a bull ass teleport. People need color. Having something to fix is a good thing. I'm used to being the one being controlled. I need to go to a place where people need color. I mean, okay. I kind of see the idea here. Everything down will give this place some color. Oh, interesting. Sure. Let's save this My siblings must be waiting for me. Are your games? Uh, I played two games, and then my internet went out for an hour. Oh, this is getting interesting. Uh, so this is my third game, fourth game, fourth game. I don't think anyone walks up to us, man. I, I don't know why anybody would be here. Maybe Lumi? There are still six teams left. Catching Pokemon with your siblings, nice. to rest peacefully. 
Unfortunate character. Uh, it's creative mode, man. I love, I love to do it. I wish I could spam my buttons forever. Uh, yeah, that's cool. Let's get forty out of that. That's fine. And this song didn't help. <laughs> See, hold on. Okay, I think I'm fucked. Uh, I'm not showing uh, Fear and Hunger. Uh, so I ran up to the Yellow Mage, uh, which is bad news. Uh, I think we need to take out his arms. But Chrome Mauler just spawned behind him, and uh, you know I'm gonna have to say that's not good. No arm. No other arm. All right, good. Oh, all right. All right, immediately run. He two opium powders. Good. Thank God. Work bow. Sounds of struggling. Air is filled with killing intent. Uh, the guard. I am slow. Damn. Item. Holy shit. Loomless ate his ass. 
That man's dick sensor? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it is. Thank goodness. You know what they did to me? Nope. Thank you for help. Without you, I'd be dead by now. Glad I could help. I'm a debt to you. Things they did. What else do you serve? Palmer. Dars. Do you think you can remember that? Would you like to travel together? Yes, please. Four party members. Four party members. White bile? That's the poison cure I need. I need worm juice. And uh, without that, we're in some fucking trouble. Light the bonfire. Perfect. Grill the meat. Yes. Perfect. Lucky coin. Good. Worm juice. Oh, we're so fucking back, dude. We do the worm juice. Worm juice into... White vial combo. Is it white vial? Antidote to poison. Alright. We're no longer infested with tapeworms. We're good. Hell yeah. Dried meat. Girl feels less hungry. Good. We're doing it. I need to, like, rest somewhere in this game. We're doing alright. I have another torch. Yeah. Take a stone. Oh no 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 no! Okay. She clearly doesn't like the yellow mage. Kill girl. Okay. Yeah, big thing about the yellow mage is that if you don't run straight at the yellow mage, you have no uh, no time to actually like fuck around when he's on screen. Uh, you lose a limb. So you don't want that. Uh, anyway, your arm's coming off now. Oh, Dar's got some skills. Prevent severe physical trauma. Yeah, but can you kill? This guy? What do you think? Oh. Moonless just like one tapped him, no? Scroll of the Black Arts. Okay, that would be really cool. Except she already knows it. Already have one of those. Dirt. Dried meat. Oh, can we equip? Light helmet, huge. That's not good. Terrifying presence is not good. Hey, guy. Cave dealer appears from the darkness. We kind of just walked at him, no? Bite his ass. Whoa, he tackled the girl. What the fuck, man? A little rude. Moonless bit his dick off. That's a good Moonless. Good job. Dude, he's fast, man. He has actually a lot of HP, too, surprisingly. Worm juice, good. Silver coins. 
Wooden buckler. I don't know what the stone crown does. I thought... The stone crown might prevent limb loss? I, it's something. I forget. Blue liquid. I think these are my healing potions. I do value moonless as well. A torch. Coins. Hello. A soul stone. Good. Now can I go back to the salmon snake with a soul stone? Girl? The girl's holding her head and shaking visibly. She seems hesitant in continuing at all. There's something wrong. He looks to be in complete shock. Don't worry, I'll make sure nothing happens to you. Hey man, are you are you chill or you're chill? He's chill. Find some random symbols. Okay. Uh oh. What I didn't wanna. Oh, you know what? I don't think I can talk to these guys because I'm with Dars. I think... I can attack... Oh, this is a woman. Yeah. Yeah, this is a traitor, but if, I guess if I have Dars with us, uh, they do not like me. Up oh, and Moonless bitter tits off. Well... Not a lot you can do about that. Oh, there goes your head. You can use a soul stone here. The dollar's down. Search. Nothing. Moonless marks your territory. Thanks. Her armor. Terrifying presence does not sound good. Oh, you're... You're just down there. Your face sounds of growling and moaning. Throw a stone to the pit. The drop does seem a bit daunting. Investigate. Crawls and moans. I don't remember what's down there. <laughs> but I think that's where we gotta go. Doesn't seem to be locked. Classic. Sorcerer's Stone? Oh, it's armor. Ring restores mind during encounters? Huge. Huge. Uh, I think I can get a rope so I don't have to jump. 
That's ideal. Hey, man. Just absolutely terrified. Oh, her mind is very low, that's why. But have you heard of my friend Opium? Earl. Sick. Smoke weed every day. Uh... Very careful, because I don't know... Oh, fuck. Um... I... I think... I think I need... To use uh, spells here. Ooh, I forget. Purifying talisman. And I don't know. Black orb. That worked. Yeah, zero damage, as I expected. The girl lost her arm. Well, that's no good. Uh... Girl, I need you to use Black Orb because you're the only damage dealer we have. And then, uh, Blue Vial. Good luck. Stop bleeding. Black Orb. You missed. How did Black Orb... Alright, well. So much for that, dude. I can't kill myself? Oh. Can I use. I'm gonna just test now. Purifying Talisman. Not on us. Oh, never mind. Run! Oh, you could just leave. Hey, maybe I should have done that instead of, you know, killing the girl. Hmm. Hey, what if I juke you? Holy shit, I'm good. Thanks, Moonless. Presence is not letting you pass. What? Run. It was unable to escape. Well, yeah, we're dead. We're fucking freaking dead. We're fucking dead as hell. Game over. Why haven't I popped yet? What if I play the sequel? No.
What if? What if we are just the sequel? God knows, I'm. Um, I don't feel like doing that last like forty-five minutes of the first game. Soldier excels at range combat. Thug boxer. Life in an underground boxing ring. Saw the boxer to deal with opponents barehanded. Still in close quarters combat. Okay. Yeah. Easier mode. Fear and hunger mode. Masochism mode. Masoch. Yeah, I guess that's supposed to be masochism. Fear and hunger mode. That's fine. Skip the character history? No. Been sent on the rail tracks. You are not used to peaceful and tranquil atmosphere. Can't help but let your mind wander. You reminisce uh, what has led you to this point in life. The majority of your life you've known the streets of the Vatican City. This is actually the first time in your life you're traveling this far from those narrow and crowded alleyways. Things don't look that fancy elsewhere. Traveling is overrated, you think to yourself. In your earliest memories, you remember spending time with your parents, but then suddenly you just didn't have parents anymore. You don't remember what happened, but from one point onwards, it was just you and your sister against the world. You're still only 10 years old, but you had to make a living somehow. Pickpocket, burglar, honest life. Uh, okay, burglar would probably give me lockpicking, though. Let's try to lead an honest life. Eventually, he messed things up and got fired, so you were able to save up 10 shillings. Nice. Street schooled you hard, but as you grew older, you noticed that you started to tower over those who bullied you before. If someone still tried to do you dirty, you were quickly able to give them a taste of your justice. As of your skill, or size and skills of fighting, you started to attract attention to local street gangs that tried to recruit you as their muscle. It's never sounded right to you. They'd been extorted of your measly salaries too many times. You don't want to do the same to anyone. Turning down small-time criminals only got you further in trouble. Okay. Almost every other night, you'd end up in street fighting. Right, so at one point you realize that you were doing more fighting than actual work, not to mention that's where you get most of your money to. Try to consider fighting as your job. Maybe it would make, uh, maybe it would be worth investing into it more. You start to work out more regularly and follow a strict regimen. Uh, train strength. This would pack more punch. Start doing more push-ups. You used animal carcasses as punching bags. Uh, where you worked part-time, you climbed fire escape ladders instead of using stairs and so on. Manage to increase your strength with a couple. With a couple of levels in the end. Nice. You were doing alright in fights so much that you started to build a little reputation. In, in no time, you moved onto the underground boxing rings where there was more money on the table and less danger of the opponent pulling a knife in the middle of a match. But you were busy in the ring. Your sister had grown into a beautiful young woman who attracted all kinds of admirers. It would have meant trouble if it wasn't for your mean reputation. Most low-life thugs on the street knew that they'd have to answer to you if they tried anything dodgy. That didn't mean that they were trying, uh, but there weren't those who tried. She started to get close with the known mobster, Ricardo Accardo. Okay. It was the heir to the Accardo branch of the family. The, the family was an organized body of criminals operating in Vatican City. In all intents and purposes, the family was a mafia, but they also had deep ties to the church, which in turn was running the country, so it was a bit more complicated. Jesus, yapping. Despite being a mobster, Ricardo seemed decent enough. He had a flirtatious and flattering way of speaking and in general got along with everyone. He took notice in your skills and tried to casually recruit you to their ranks. You politely declined. Since you didn't take the offer, Ricardo had another one on the platter. He proposed that he'd hook you up with a real boxing trainer to get you to the next level. You again declined, but your sister insisted that you at least try it out, so you agreed. Things started to feel more professional the second you stepped inside the gym. The trainer, an elderly gentleman, an impressive record of previous apprentices, was impressed by your raw skill. Thought that the best way to push uh, you further would be to choose where to specialize. Specialize in accuracy, in evasion, in defense, and in offense. What about in evasion? I'll learn bob and weave. 
This method's proved effective soon you had your first real bout in the ring and won the match with relative ease. Your sister and Ricardo were there to congratulate you. You continue with your winning streak. The hype around you was growing slowly, even you started to believe the hype. Ricardo was able to organize big matches one after another. You started spending more uh, time inside the family quarters with Ricardo and your sister. Without noticing it, you had been pulled into the criminal world. What started as a helping out a friend became a more frequent occurrence. Soon Ricardo showed his true colors as well. He had been building you up for a faded boxing match. Apparently your next opponent was a former family member who had cut all ties to the organization. Your job was to kill him. You politely declined, but at this point there was no turning back. Ricardo reminded you that he got your sister back at his flat and she'd feel it in her skin if you didn't comply. You didn't know what to do. Soon you found yourself in the ring with the ex-family member and the bell rang. It's a tough opponent, but you managed to get the best of him. You were able to counter one of his attacks with a knockout hit. Things moved in slow motion as you saw Ricardo in your corner nodding with a sly smile. You followed up your hit with another and another and another. You didn't stop it. Even when the man hit the ground, the referee had to pull you away with all he got before you stopped. The damage had already been done. You had killed the person. You were devastated by all this, but kept it all inside. This was only the beginning. Ricardo had plenty of dirty work for you to do at this point. He had plenty of leverage. Your, your sister being the last resort every time you hesitated. Things had to change. Uh, get rid of Ricardo or get your sister and flee the, get your sister and flee the country. You learned escape plan. You can find your sister anywhere, calling her telephone, nothing. You sure to suspect that Ricardo is suspected something like this. Seeing your sister somewhere, you were off no choice but to confront him. Ricardo was wary of you. He seemed to sense your killing intent from miles away, and that's why he avoided seeing you alone to the best of his abilities. He was too cocky to consider you a serious threat, so if he had you under his thumb, that proved out to be a grave mistake for him. You were to meet Ricardo and a dozen of his henchmen at a local club to discuss another one of your many tasks. You had been waiting for an opportunity to see him alone. That opportunity never presented itself fair enough, you thought. The moment you got to a, to a punching distance, Ricardo had a split-second realization of what was happening before you knocked him off his feet. The little rat tried to slither away, but you grabbed him by his throat and kept slamming into the floor until he stopped moving. In your rage, you lifted him up and threw him over the railing. He fell from the second floor to the center of the club's dance floor. You saw him fall headfirst to the ground. You had succeeded in what you set out to do. Getting out of the club was secondary. You had to fight through a mob of Ricardo's goons. Somehow you made it out of the from the back door with only minor injuries and ran away as fast as you could. You ran from the crime scene. Uh, the problem was now that both the family and the law enforcement of the city were after you. Just then you received a, a phone call from your sister. She had been sent to Ricardo Somerville in the country of Valen some days prior. You explained the situation to her and two of you decided to meet up in the country of Ronda and there was no possibility of you living in the Vatican City anymore. You had to act fast before the police would catch up to you. What do you take with you before leaving the city? Uh, medical goods. Blue vials and cloth fragment. Nice. First train left the country. Destination was an obscure little town called Preheville. Pre Preheville? In the country of Bohemia. You had no idea where this place was. Figured you could plan your trip once you got there. Save your character history. Yes. Skip the intro. No. I gotta be, like, bugged or something, right? Well, let me cancel and, like, Nope, I'm not bugged. I feel like someone's watching you while you slept. Uh oh. Oh, I can move. Valerie, man. Excuse me. No answer. Okay. Here's the luggage. You find cloth fragments. Found a pipe. But I fight better without a pipe. Correct? Oh, 
whole thing is like He feels off. Oh, show. Blaze is not the train anymore. Janitor, you. I've been looking for you everywhere. Just where do you think you ran off to? Don't you understand the hurry we're in? I don't understand. The eyes of the janitor bulge out from their socket as his expression intensifies. No one expects you to. You're a stupid fucking human after all. Get your ass back to the workbench. This is your last chance. Next time, it's punishing time. So what am I supposed to do? We are supposed to assemble new cubes, of course. Figure it out yourself. If you're not capable of that much, you're beyond hope and useless in every sense of the word. Are you? What you googling at? We're gonna see here. Eyes on the cubes. Work or I'll rip those eyes out of your pretty face. Use directional keys to assemble cubes. Okay, I gotta start with up. The only thing is trying to get your attention. Oh. Where do you think you're going? Uh oh. Jenner sits down blocking your way. Can I talk to him? Stupid human, stupid human, imbecile, sleep your throat, you alive, that'll teach you. Lame me, I'll finish the job on your back after we're done here. He doesn't care about your threats. Ouch. How many people you think buy ultimate clears? Uh, a lot of them. I lost my arm. Am I dead? I was defeated. Did you run away? You dash around like a little jailbird with these chicken thighs of yours. I'll get back to work. This is like a dream, right? This is like a tutorial, for sure. Oh, I can move, wait, can I move diagonally for real? Wait, that's sick. That's innovation. Like every time there's a Heaven's Legend in my group, they're the one fucking up the most. Uh, yeah. That makes sense. Maybe, I, I don't know. Do you think people pay for Heaven's Legend more than any other title? Are they paying for the titles, you think? When your head hurts, you feel like you're losing your mind. Hey, what up? What up, gods? You haven't done any other uh, ultimates, so I've only experienced them in this one. Oh. Maybe just DSR. In general. I'm back. I'm back and I got my limbs. Because that was a tutorial and I was right. <laughs> Oh, there you are. 
serious person greets you in a monot monotonous voice. Got you pulled out from that nasty place. You were going deep into that rabbit hole. Show his good will. My master has mended your wounds and tatters this once. What a joy. Now you're safe under the beautiful green hue of the moon. Welcome to the moon tower. Thank you for getting me out of there. You're welcome. Since our words could not possibly reach my master, I speak in his behalf. Who might my master be? For now, let's just say that he is the delinquent one. The rare, the, the trickster moon god. And me, you call me Hercule. I'm just a humble servant of, of his celestial majesty. Hercule? Herc? You are the dreamer, he is the dream. My master has invited 14 of you to join us in this jubilee of cosmic proportions. 14 candidates, but only one victor. Festival of Termina is upon us. What is the Festival of Termina? The festival to give you, the humans, a peak to grandeur and a chance to reach for illustrious heights. Ooh, festival to end all festivals. This must be all very confusing to you. I won't burden you with any more information at this very moment. Just head towards the tower. This is all you need to know for now. I will gladly answer your questions once you get there, but until that, let us meet again under the moonlight. Okay. Goodbye. You wake up suddenly. It was all a dream. The train has stopped. Oh, it's it's got me fucked up that I can move fucking diagonally now. Oh, I can run! Let's fucking go. So is running just stamina? And it's just... Hey, what up? Man, the suit is talking to himself. He seems to be completely lost in his own thoughts. I'm late already. So late. Alright. So yeah. Man with checkered pants says, So that must be the best course of action for now. You interrupted discussion. Oh, the big Chad got up? That's me. Who are you? What's going on? You must be just as clueless as the rest of us. The train left us all here at the outskirts of the city. All the train personnel, everything, everyone gone, no explanations. That's odd. Mystery, alright. We decided to stay and wait here for a while. Someone has to come for the train sooner or later. If you're not in a hurry, I recommend just taking a seat inside and trying to relax. Maybe we could introduce ourselves? Introduce yourself. My name is Marina. My name is Olivia. Lovely to meet you all. You can call me August. Aaron Soar, a journalist on duty. Hey, I'm Henry. And this mystic gentleman over here is Osa. It was Osa, right? Silly man. Pretty sure it was. We were the, we were the first to wake up. Before you came out, we were talking about this. You saw a peculiar nightmare as well, didn't you? How did you know that? Everyone saw the same dream before waking up in the train. The moon, the girl in a pink dress, the festival of Termina. All felt too real to pass off as just a dream. Not this talk again. We should have asked that army pig, that Bremen pig. In way too much of a hurry to leave, I bet he knew something. It smells like a sadistic army experiment. Sounds exactly like something Bremen army would be a part of. <clears throat> they had similar hallucinogens experience, experimented on war prisoners. Now that the war is over, they have to get their guinea pigs elsewhere. I wish I had your capacity and feist, but I really have a hard time believing every conspiracy theory floating around. Ooh, I'm a journalist. I've covered wars, you know. Wow. Reference. I need some flaky eyepatch foreigner telling me what's possible and what's not. You haven't seen what I've seen during these past few years. I've covered wars too, you know. All men and women for the past decade or two have covered wars. What's your point again? I've seen my fair share of hallucinogens as a doctor, and I can tell from a first-hand experience that there are no known chemicals that create vi visions that vivid. Especially visions that are identical with this many people. You can feel the tension rising between these two people. Deep sigh. I take it that we're done here. As much as I'd like it, I don't have enough time. I don't have time to play happy campers with you people. I have a job to do. Which way is the city? Look up there, over the forest top. 
Can you see the tower standing erect in the mist? That tower marks the center of Kravil. You can hike through the forest to get there. It's not that far away. Alright then. If I see anyone, I'll let them know that you guys are waiting here. I've been fighting a scoop from that sleepy town. You know where to find us if anything comes up. What are you gonna do? Wait here, I guess. I'm not in a hurry. Okay. Day one monologue with the moon. Or Good afternoon. Ida Tanaka, good to make your acquaintance. It's really troublesome what has come from of our train trip. I'm not entirely certain on what to do. I have some urgent business at the city. Should I go on foot or wait for the train? Uh, wait for the train. Maybe I'll do that, yes. Yeah, you can wait at the train. I should get inside the Mrs. Creeping and attack her. You talk about the dream? Yes, of course. What do you think the dream means? It was a premonition. I really hope not. Something more. Never mind. Okay. Would you look at that behind? <laughs> Are you dead serious? If you get that up, I'll come up with a better use for that wrench. You've been making yourself useful. Maybe I will do just that. Just wait and see Ginger. Oh my god. It will make me proud. What is it that you want? What do you think about the dream? It's interesting. What about you? What do you think of it? It's been a premonition. Vision perhaps, but a premonition? I'm not so sure about that. What's your story? In Penrick 32, Shaft, single, Sodi, Exxon, suffocated soul, what else? Let's see. What brings you here? That is private, man. He's got to keep at least some of his secrets. Nice day, isn't it? A bit foggy. True enough. It is peaceful in its own right, don't you think? You say so. Uh, the sleepy one. What's your story? My story got me more specific. I'm too complicated for a few lines of dialogue. What brings you here? It's my hometown. I'm originally from here. I never admitted in a conversation that it was from such a depressing, godforsaken small town. You'll only make yourself look stupid if you were spreading the word. I thought Preville was a medium-sized city. Even medium-sized cities can be uncivilized, believe me. Okay. Stay in a bed, and leave your stream up to lurk. Good night. Hey, have a good night. Thanks for chilling out. You recognize this man. He's Caligura, also known as Count Dragul, one of the uh, Capo regime or captains. A rival branch in the family. You have no idea what he's doing here, though. Would he be on to you? The fuck do you want? How are you doing? And just gives a look directly at you without saying a word, and you're not sure whether he recognizes you or not. What's your problem? Hey? You mad as hell. I finally got dodged. Holy shit, dude. That took... Oh, no, I didn't. There's nothing on the train, right? I thought I could, like, sit here. Or something. I guess the game is trying to tell me to fuck off. And again, these army barricades suggest that there might be... Uh, maybe there is something to do with crazy theory of hers. Something doesn't seem right here. What do you plan to do? We'll just head out too. There's no telling how long it takes for someone to come for the train. The city's right around the corner. What? I can't talk to... What's her name? Angela? Up a blue herb. I feel like I'm not supposed to go this way. 
This creeps in from the woods, okay? Perfect view of old time wait maiden woods. Oh, let me head back. Find an egg. Dried meat. An egg. Rod meat takes some. Plank shield. I wonder if I can equip the plank shield. Yeah. Offers a little protection. Oops. Rat. Egg. Meat pot. Lavender. Three silence fills the air, devoid of any life. There's some blood over here. Hacked off leg. Hacked off arm. Yeah, okay. Slowly creeps in. Oh. Hermina is upon us. Oh, hey, man. Uh, I'm good. Peace. Body is badly mutilated. Yo, what a goat? There's a lone goat here. It seems to be minding its own business, completely ignoring your presence. Investigate. On the first glance, the creature seems harm harmless, but upon further investigating it, you are met with feelings of great dread. Can't really explain why this is. Head it. It almost feels like the goat thinks so highly of itself that it doesn't need to acknowledge you. Good. Egg. Blue herb. Own candle. Find a glass of shards. Something sticky and yellow seeping from inside that makes the refrigerator door stuck. Open it with force. Kind of white vial. Find glass shards. Oh, 
Looks like blood. Listen, no sounds coming from down there. Chains are really tight. Random junk around the table looks like someone escaped here recently. You find the woodsman's letter. Proof? The beast has entered this house. It is not my property any longer. The beast took my wife. It took my dignity. It took my faith. It wasn't the full moon. I would let it take my life as well but by my own hand. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Oh? Wait. Basics of alchemy. Who has healing properties? Green prevents infections. Red has no effect on its own. Used together with other herbs. They have a boosting effect. Lavender, the smell of lavender can be used to ease anxiety and fear. I feel like they just did like a, a reverse Resident Evil here where it's not like green and red for healing it's just like green and red for poison green is poison cool. that looks dirty and smells bad rest for a bit your heavy breathing through your sleep hey man What is going on here? Clearly out for blood. Hatchet. Miss. His pine cone pig is pulsating. We're gonna hit bob and weave. Ow. Bitch. Beat his ass, Marco. Now what? You have no arms. Remove his leg tackle. Dodge. Remove his leg tackle. Dodge. Wait, what if I go for the kill shot? The... Am I punching his limbs off? Yeah, Marco is just the JoJo insert, so he unironically is punching limbs off. Yeah. How strong he is. Found a basement key, he will also take the axe. Eat him. Okay. We'll be back. Open the chains with the basement key? Yep. Burn it. Hey there. There's a seemingly dead old lady here. She seems to be holding tight on the piece of paper. Check the paper. I'll reunite with my lover on the other side.
recipes. All nonsensical ramblings. Use more man than you'll, you could have ever been. Twice the size, in fact. I let his cold member inside me. Even my loins couldn't uh, warm it up. Yes, I did it. I laid with black cowlip. I tasted his seed. Okay. I think she fucked the goat. You find duct tape? Excuse me? Actually written like... Oh. It's duct tape on the inventory screen, but... It said duct tape when I looted it. Like the animal. Curious. Alright. Recipes. Good names traditional recipes dating back to the 15th century. Word. I know how to make meat pies now? Is that what the fuck it just said? Craft item. Yeah, I can make meat pies. Blue vials. We said green herb is poison, right? Duct tape. Wait, was that it? Was it just the fucking the circle and the old lady? Best fuck of my life. God damn it, man. Fried meat. Nice. Hey, what up, goat? Give it a carrot. Goat eats the carrot without any festivities. Still doesn't acknowledge your existence in the slightest. Alright. So be it. Reveal Old Town. Near distant screams and ramblings. You are not alone. Where is boarded up on the outside? To keep something in? Looks like something is standing still in the darkness. Bloody toilet hole. Seatings are covered in blood and feces and semen. There's absolutely nothing inside except the previously mentioned blood, feces, and semen. Boy bile. Bloody ritual crucifix. They used to have these in the olden times, but you've never seen one in person. Some of say the sacrifice corpses are repulsive. You feel like throwing up. Oh, that's a... A villa da. Red herbs, fur, shillings, rotten meat. Surely I can walk past you. Oh! Okay, no. And we're quick. Scared to walk off the beaten path. I feel like 
to walk off the path in general. Oh, hello. Censored horse. The outskirts. It's the goat again. I just looped around. God damn it, man. How did I, how did I manage this? We're in a big fucking circle. Maybe I just fight people. Maybe that was my calling all along. Beat some ass. My Q reset. By the way. Uh oh. Hey, this isn't a good spot, huh? He forgot I existed. Okay, I don't like the pig man. Alright, good. Get the pig man stuck. He's really fucking fast. I don't like him. Maybe I can just fight the woman. The lone villager stumbles in your path. Bob and weave. Ow. Oh. Dodge. Rev up. Rear arm. Ow. Oh. I'm infected? Oh no. Destroy the arm. Destroy the leg. Bop, bop, bop. Tackle. Oh. Bop, bop, bop. Why can you still tackle me with no legs? Loses her balance. Can I talk to them? Oh. Stab, stab, stab. Let's die already. Quirk. Searcher. She's a knife. I need... Green herb. I am infected. I think this guy wants to fight me. Surely not, right? I don't think he does. I don't know, man. You're better than this. Just kidding. Fuck you. Do you? Wheat flour. Wheat flour. Moldy bread. I don't want to do that. Hard black matter. Someone actually made this. It doesn't look like food. There seems to be pasta in there, so I'll take some. I'm sure that's useful for something. Uh, food. Craft a meat pie. Sick.
egg mushroom well there's a woman here She doesn't really scream. Okay. Downstairs. Me pie goat hoof. Skin Bible. Oh. Huh? Strongly called both written in medieval times by Enki. Hey, that was the other guy. The other character. Do I want to read the skin bible? I feel like that's not a good idea. Something tells me I want to save it first. Also, I don't know if we're going to pop. We've been at like... 18 to 20 people for like... An hour. You unlock the basement doors? Oh. Cool. Come to the Cobalt queue. I'm not playing Cobalt. Okay. Either I get another rank game out of my like four rank games I got, or I fucking play Fear and Hunger. Run. Run. He is like friendly with two different padlocks. I think I can force the gate. I know how useless that is. Oh shit. Pigman. The word is locked with a simple lock. Close until tomorrow. God damn it, man. Wait, I, why am I knocking on the coffins, man? Why does that make sense? Why would I do that? Atmosphere is getting heavier and heavier. Okay. Basin seems dank and dark, as if something lurks down there waiting for you. Why do I... Why do you say that? Why would something be waiting for me down there? Kind of the only place to go, though. Sure. Rotten meat. What's this? Lucky coin. Blue herb, egg. Give it a flip. Oh. Find the... The what? The Mahabre? Isn't that... I feel like if I read that... <laughs> There's significance there. Okay. Oh, well. Where'd my raid go? Um... I died, Jim. You're really not gonna leave the doorway. Oh, he he started to. Oh shit, he he just leaves. Yeah, fuck you. Why are these guys so fast? Get this off. Oh my. Oh, your AI sucks. Oh shit.
problem we've I'm running out of health. Good dodge. Arm. Bop bop. No arm. He sets up a bear trap. Do I run away? How the fuck do I? Can I attack the bear trap? Do I have to attack the bear trap? How does this work? Yeah, I do. Fuck you. No arms. Now what? Is this fear and hunger? Yeah, it's the second one. I was playing the the first game in queue, and then uh, I lost like an hour of progress, so I'm just playing the second one. The wooden chest here. Heads. Heard this is brutal. Yep. Found two bullets. And a cold from Mars. Nothing left. It's a ritual circle. Pray for the new gods. You finish praying. Give an offering. There's someone there. Are you okay? Uh oh. Okay, so I do have a heal. Was it blue is healing? I'll be heal thirty. Huge. White vials. Bed looks to be in bad shape and very uncomfortable. Oh, super eye patch wolves vid on this. Dude nearly lost his mind. Yeah. I mean, so far this game is more forgiving and has like a tutorial. I think. I think this one's like definitely more accessible. In that regard. I'm sure I'm going to die in a second anyway. Nope. Oh. Did not flip right. Oh, that's a gate. Okay. That's a guy. Alright, juke his ass. Oh, I didn't... I have to force the door. I don't think I can... Beat this door down. Door's too strong for you. Alright, well. What the fuck is this? Dead body. Search. Something bulging in his pocket. A diary. Oh, fuck. I thought I could run to the left. Bob and weave. Sickle. I'll do it. Ouch. Head or tails? Great, man. Tails, bear trap. Okay, wait. Bobbing and weaving is it trips the bear trap? I thought only if I attack him. Well, that's some bullshit. Oh, I don't have a leg anymore. That's not good. Punch this guy's dick off. I can't. I can punch his head off. I miss. He might kill me with tackles, to be honest. Marco is victorious. I'm not doing so good. I'm missing a leg and I'm bleeding now. Yeah. Okay, I can cover up the bleeding. Uh, 
heal myself a little bit, but. Eat a meat pie, you know, maybe that'll help me out a little bit. Okay. So I'm moving fine without the leg, you know, to be honest. Grab his dick and twist it. Wow, dude, Automod hates you. Oh, I just can't run now. Oh. I guess it's got a gun. This must be the television room? How did you know that? Why did you say that? Why, why, did, why did the game get interrupted by that? Like, it pauses the game straight up to be like, this is the television room. Very strange. Drink water. I don't have any water. Sickle. Hair rip. Red herb. Moldy bread. And. I'm gonna drink cum. I can drink cum if you want. That guy looks like he is. Oh, oh. Can't really. Well. Oh. Praise Villager runs at you in a blind fury. Hold up, man. Moon scorched. Can I punch your neck off? Can I just run? Oh, he's kind of got me back into a corner. I can't really go anywhere. Can I talk to him? Oh. You miserable piece of... Get back or else. Scared much? He just bit me. Oh my god. Wait, I got fucked up. Punch his head. He died. Instantly. Why didn't I just fucking fight him? Search. Tobacco. Killings. I should just be beating the shit out of everybody. I don't know why I'm like... Acting like I can't. Am I infected again? I'm infected and I have bleeding. Great. Red herb. Thanks. Go to... Can you fuck off? Thanks. All severed heads. Hang on. Wretched being, the dark corner of the unwanted and the undesired, where they're, they dumped the disease still born, and now the moon scorched. Welcome, O oh fresh one. Welcome to the shit pit of Craveal. Nice decoration you got there. I want more, though. I want the one who swept half the old town down, the woodsman. And I want the one who condemned us down here. I want the filthy priest. I'll see what I can do. Okay, well, I already killed the woodsman, so... Need his head. And I have no way to chop it off. Shit. Knock on the coffin. Are these guys okay? Don't be shack. Open it up. 
I'm gonna have a maintenance tunnel. Okay. Three bolts. Bone saw. Okay, bone saw. Can I now remove? Heads? Bone saw is ready. Can I take the broom? But I didn't even know I could do that. Why would I do that? Pissed when he turns around and sees me. Okay, the bear traps. I'm mindful. Person is barely alive. You can hear the death rattle coming from him. Finish him. He's dead now. Saw off his head. Okay, I got the option now. Squirt's head as a trophy. What the fuck is this? Food? Yeah. Do be food. The cube keeps lowering in players. Yeah, I think cues have been dead for like an hour. Oh, you son of a bitch. Right, this bob and weave better come in handy. Ouch. Dodge. How am I infected? Oh, what? I ran up to that guy and fucking ate his ass. Gunpowders. Now let me take a set. Took the rifleman's head as a trophy. Um. Herbs. That worked. Kind of interfere in hunger right now, dude. At least until I'm killed. Kind of pissed I didn't get to play um, more games today. I got cucked by New York internet. The entire fucking ISP went down for like an hour in the middle of uh, my game. It's very good. What the fuck is all this? 
Is that a green herb? We'll grab that. Thanks. Back to the woods again. We're back at the train. I have a wheelchair. Since for majority, blah blah blah, just seems obvious. Or, hey guys, I don't have a leg. Oh, there's a bone saw in the luggage. Maybe I should have checked it earlier. What the fuck? Hey, what? What the fuck was that? Okay. Oops. Rest for a bit. I could do that. Or I could experience horrors beyond my wildest comprehensions. So, think about that. Wing herb, huge. Which way got me to uh, the woodsman's place? It was this way. Cut his dick off. Let me rip his penis off. Wait, hold on. He's upstairs. Right. Call me sleeping. And he's still here. Give me your head. Captain's head is a trophy. Nice. Where the 
who the head collector is, but I guess we'll find him. Oh shit, I can't run from this guy. Well... I guess we bob and weave. Pesticide spray. Dodge it. Oh. That was uh, a lot of... Did I get poisoned? I got fucked up. I got poisoned and then he beat the shit out of me. Is this just going to kill me? Okay. Oh. Great. Sounds good. Dead. And that means I'm dead. Oh, let me. I remembered. I remembered. Look at this shit. I forgot you could do this. Free shit. Alright, sick. Okay. Well. Day coins. Oh, ho, ho, ho. some fucking money. All right, I'm going. The buy from me. I only got to play like three or four games or something. How shitty. Sucks. All right. Goodbye, 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 goodbye.